Imagine this, it's a warm summer night and friends are coming over and you have no idea what to cook for them. Here is a great Greek inspired recipe that consists of three amazing dishes. Come with me. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel Melmi Food and Lifestyle Melmi, it's me Imagine this, it's a warm summer night and some friends and family are coming over and you have no idea what to cook Here I will show you how to make this Greek inspired snack plate that consists of the chicky sauce hummus and some amazing pan-fried feta cheese with sesame seeds. Come with me. For the first recipe, I start with preparing cucumber for tachiki. Grate cucumber with medium-sized grater. You already see how much water comes out from the cucumber. You do not want this water in your sauce. Just take all the cucumber and squeeze all the water out until like this. Cucumber is about 96% water, so all this needs to come out. You can use your hand or a kitchen towel to do this. The dry cucumber in a separate bowl and grate some garlic into it. Squeeze some lemon juice. And add the Greek style thick yogurt. Season it with some salt. Chop some parsley in it. Finish up with some grated black pepper and a little bit of olive oil. Give the sauce a good mix and leave it aside to take in all the flavors and leave it to be eaten. Next up is the hummus. For that I am using my new help in the kitchen thermomix but you can also use a normal kitchen blender just put into the mixing bowl your chickpeas half of lemon juice don't worry about the seeds at, as it will all blend together add three tablespoons of tahini that's sesame paste it's very important for this recipe Add some salt and start blending all the same time. In a medium speed, slowly adding the olive oil to the mixture. Slowly adding the olive oil to the mixture, it is important to get the desired texture nice creamy and smooth it will take around 60 milliliters of oil for smooth texture and for finish you can add a little bit of water to make it super smooth blend it for a few minutes and it's ready so smooth and creamy looking so good
For frying the cheese, I prepared three containers with flour, eggs, and sesame seeds. Heat your pan and first dip the cheese into the flour. Make sure all sides are with flour. After that, put the cheese into the egg mixture and thirdly, cover the cheese with sesame seeds. Make sure all six sides have even layer of sesame seeds on it. Preheat the pan and make the same for the other piece of cheese. Place the sesame covered cheese on a hot pan. Fry the cheese evenly on all sides until all sides have golden brown color. And the cheese inside has softened a little bit, like this. Amazing! This Greek style feta cheese is made out of sheep's milk. This is nice texture for frying because feta cheese won't melt as much as normal cheese. For dipping the sauce I have two types of bread, one flat bread and normal bread. These I will give some color and flavor with a torch. You can also do this in the oven with high temperature but it will not be the same taste. This is also for the bread not to get soggy and it will combine so well with the cheese, the hummus and the chicky sauce. And all this does not take more than 45 minutes to prepare. Start plating like this. First put the chicky sauce in a glass bowl. Take a wooden board and just spread the hummus on it on one side. Put the hummus all in a big pile on the board and gently spread it around, leaving a smaller hole in the center. This is perfect to be shared with friends. Place the pan fried sesame feta on the side and decorate with the flat bread like this. You can also have the dried bread or crostinis on it. Decorate the hummus with some pomegranate seeds, some chopped parsley. Decorate the tachiki with parsley and cucumber. Finish it off with some amazing kalamata olives. And Finish by drizzling some olive oil on the hummus. Voila! Ready to be perfect host. Some sweetness. Add some honey on the cheese for bringing out the amazing flavors. You have just prepared yourself a perfect platter to be shared with friends and family. Enjoy! Your friends have arrived to your place and you are serving them this amazing Greek-inspired platter full of flavor, freshness, and nobody will feel full that they can't move. They be like, wow, what is this amazingness? Here, you just need the bread and dip it into the nice tachiki sauce and enjoy. Mm -mm -mm. On the side, you can take some hummus and some amazing Greek Kalamata olives. Like this. And finish off with this amazing fried feta cheese. Please remember to subscribe to my channel, ring the bell and put a like. Thank you. Bye.